hi hope you're having an amazing day as you saw from the title of this video we're going to be going through my top products and lip combinations that i've been loving throughout these couple what i believe it's either has it been a year it's just like i've been really into that kind of nude like dark rich brown lip liner nude on me and i'm loving it because it goes with every single look so i'm going to give you guys various options on lip liners on liquid lipsticks on lipsticks and glosses so if you want to see what products i'm recommending for you and your collection you probably already have these products so i'm just going to give you guys some recommendations if you haven't seen some of my lip liners that i use i love to interchange between all of these products so if you want to see the products that i'm mentioning today just keep on watching but before that don't forget if you like drugs and makeup go ahead and stick around subscribe maybe hit the bell so you're notified whenever i upload and if you could like the video if you like it and the video is going to start right now the so roll up the sleeves because we're going to do quite a bit of swatching in this video specifically let's go ahead and start with lip liners i have a couple of top lip liners that i love and i'm obsessed with three of them are from ebony york so we're going to start off with the color pop one this one has been a more recent one to my collection that i've been loving i am obsessed with this shade this is the ColourPop lippy pencil in the shade petal please i actually just purchased a couple of new backups and i can't wait to get through them i already sharpened it and it's so easy to sharpen as well it didn't break at all it's so creamy it's such a great formula this is actually one of my newer ones and that is the shade petal please it's so stunning and it goes so perfectly with any like toppers that i put over it it's extremely creamy they all just kind of mesh together on the lips so amazing if you love that kind of brown classic um, liner look with a gloss over top or even just a little bit of lipstick um, in the center you're gonna love this liner it's so good i have some other alternative lip liners i love the ebony new york lip liners they retail for i believe it was 135 five or something like that when i search on their website they look like, it looks like now they're one dollar i don't know if they're having a sale but these are so good also really creamy and these are retractable so you don't have to sharpen them and this is their secret of feral lip and auto eyeliner so you can um, double it as an eyeliner if you wanted to and this is in the shade of brown and this one as well is so nice this is a little deeper than the color pop one but this was like my first love i loved reaching for this and just throwing it on under that brown kind of lip and throwing on lip gloss over it it just defines the lips so beautifully definitely a fave in my collection i love this one i bought various shades in this lip liner it's amazing again retractable and super inexpensive I have a couple of their gel liners as well from their uh 24 hour gel lip liner collection thing that they have i have two shades this one here's in chocolate brown this one here is in brown cocoa so all of these are amazing i love all the shades but my most favorite if i had to pick one and that i recommend to you is the ColourPop lippy pencil that's just my favorite that's my top lip liner at the moment which is why i had to go out and buy some backups if you have a dupe that's cheaper um, for you know that color pop lip liner let me know down below or what's your favorite um, dark brown lip liner that's affordable because i feel like i much rather pay one dollar since i go through my lip liners really quickly than i believe it's six dollars that the color pop lippy pencil is now it has lasted me a long time so for now i think it's perfect but i wish i could find a cheaper dupe or maybe a color dupe on the ebony your website i'm definitely gonna have to um, get on that but it's just um, the perfect kind of brown shade for me but you can't go wrong with the ebony york lip liners they're really creamy and they're really nice as well they just go with every single lip combo that i do so those are the lip liners that i've been kind of swapping and interchanging with um, throughout this year so we have quite a bit of liquid lipsticks to go through basically all like my brownie kind of liquid lipsticks i interchange with i have quite a bit of those accumulated but let's start off with the lipstick of choice that i love is a metamorphosis lipstick in the shade dreaming i've been obsessed with this since i received it it's such a great shade it's really inexpensive as well on their website i did purchase another shade um and then i saw this one and i was like yeah i need to purchase it because it is that light kind of shade i love getting some on my finger and tapping it in the center of the lip and it just creates the most beautiful ombre lip i love it 
stunning let me give it a swatch for you guys actually and it's still available on their website it's such a beautiful shade i haven't worn it on its own but again the way that i use it is just tapping in the center of the lip and it looks stunning um so this is definitely a recommend i already mentioned it in my favorites video it's an amazing product i'm going to tackle some honorable mentions in this video the beauty creations of velvet stay lip paints i just filmed my new makeup um, video recently i'll have that down below if you didn't watch using a bunch of new beauty creations makeup i use their new um, foundation it was a lot of fun so again that's going to be down below if you want to watch i did buy two of their liquid lipsticks and both of them are beautiful this one here is in the shade choco latte and then if you're into that more peachy type of nude shade, you're going to love this one in cappuccino. I'm definitely more drawn towards the chocolate one, but this one is the cappuccino shade. It's more of an honorable mention because they're newer to my collection, but I know I'm going to be reaching for that chocolate shade. Um, it's stunning so definitely wanted to mention these in this video they're really inexpensive i love the packaging and the formula is really nice as well this one honestly i don't even know why i threw in here because you guys can't really get your hands on them i actually um well i believe it was my boyfriend purchased this for christmas for me not this exactly but it was a tin from black heart cosmetics from hot topic and it's a little tin it's like black and it comes with four liquid lipsticks um so this is the one that survived in my collection because it's such a kind of really nude um liquid lipstick and it's so beautiful and i don't know why i mentioned it because it's a little hard to find but i love this shade so i've been using this non-stop um since i started wearing those nude lips it just goes with every single look and it's a stunning brownie type of tone the next one is the ellie colors velvet plush creamy lip color in the shade teddy also another perfect shade it's so beautiful all these shades are going to be a little similar but i'm just giving you guys again more options so stunning another contender is the aoa studio liquid lipstick i believe these are called their wonder mattes liquid lipsticks and this one's in the shade of vibin this is one of the first liquid lipstick that well the first um combination that i tried with the nude lips that i was obsessed with if you guys remember i believe it was in the beginning of 2020 when i started wearing nude lips and just that dark rich lip liner with this topped over with a gloss and this definitely was what sparked my love for the nude lip and that is the shade vibin so pretty and i believe it's still available on the chamisse site we have two more to go this is the uh, beauty creation seal the deal liquid lipstick and this one's in the shade last touch really stunning again really love the packaging that's a dofa applicator and this is the shade seal the deal really stunning and the last one that i have here is actually one that i had forgotten about because it was a little hidden in my collection but it's the elf liquid matte lipstick and this one's in the shade praline another great product and such a stunning shade i really like the dofa applicator let me give you guys a swatch of this it's also stunning for those nude lips all of these are so beautiful i've actually never compared them on my hand but all of them are so different yet they all look stunning um, paired with that lip liner and a gloss like any of those brown lip liners and a gloss they look so beautiful i don't think i'm going to swatch the glosses now we're getting into those because some of them are clear some of them are just a shade that they look at the tube let's start off with my most favorite one this is my top contender for glosses when i'm doing a nude lip because it's so stunning i'm actually going to throw some on right now and just because the gloss that i'm wearing is already kind of coming off but it's such a beautiful gloss. I don't want to over apply it. As you can see, it just added it's such a, a beautiful kind of glossy finish to the lips. It's so stunning. Literally $1 at the 99 cent store. They are still available there or even at Dollar Tree. It's such a great formula. And I've been really tempted to buy a, like a backup or another shade as well. I've seen a red one that's really calling my name each time that I go to the 99. So amazing, $1 Remy Rose. Don't miss out on their products. They have some really great products. So definitely recommend you guys check out this one. Oh my God, it's so amazing. I love it. Some clear kind of lip glosses that I've been loving pairing with my nude lips because these are very comfortable. They go on, they're really nice on the lips. They're not sticky or gloopy at all. It's the AOA Studio Squaw Lips um, lip glosses. I have one in the clear and then I have the glittery one, both of them little what did i say the glittery one um both of them are amazing definitely recommend these these are also really nice some other ones when i want to throw on a kind of fun 
um, different kind of gloss over top my nude lips I reach for these which are their second look cosmetics luminous lip glosses this one here is an eclipse and this one's in halo I specifically love this one when I'm doing that pinky kind of nude so beautiful I love these glosses they're amazing super inexpensive definitely recommend these as well so so good these I actually purchased at the 99 cent store they came in a set and they came with four glosses each one has a different type of undertone and they all look stunning on the lips so i definitely recommend these these are from elite beauty if you see them they look stunning especially if you're into the new lips like all the time i think you're gonna love these and they just all work so well lastly is the metamorphosis honey lip gloss i can't believe this i don't think this is available on their website anymore hopefully they bring it back but this one's also another stunning gloss yeah this one hopefully they bring it back it's so amazing and it just gives the most beautiful finish to any like gloss because it is that kind of yellowy tone it's so stunning definitely recommend I'll have the video where I use this product linked down below because I mean the finish it was everything I loved it so this has definitely become one of my favorite glasses when I'm doing my nude lips with that we made it to the end I hope you enjoyed watching as much as I enjoyed filming this for you today everything that I talked about other names of the prices are going to be down below as well as any videos that I mentioned throughout this video or videos that I uploaded last week don't forget I upload three times a week on Tuesday Thursday and Sunday so if you could stick around that would be amazing I have my insta handle displayed on the screen I post a little makeup finds from drugstore to high end so if they're interested you go ahead and follow me there it'd be so amazing if you could like and subscribe of course you don't have to do your own personal make your own decisions but it wouldn't hurt to give this video a like and i'll see you guys on the next one bye